All right, fellas, in this particular video, I want to showcase how we can change the spacing before a particular paragraph and then the spacing afterwards to make sure they're not too sort of compressed and um, too close to each other. Now, look, if you're starting off your document, ideally, there's nothing created so far. Again, all I would do then is go to select, select all. And you can see in this case, there is literally a wee bit of gray stuff here on the top left hand side. That's pretty much it. I would then right click on that and that's going to give us a number of different options. If you scroll down to where it says paragraph and then left click on that, that gives you a number of options here. All right. Now don't worry so much about the alignment just yet. You'll come back and look at the video in relation to later on for justification of your text. But please make sure that the indentation should be by default set to zero and zero there as well. Now in relation to spacing before, I would bring that up to six and the spacing afterwards, I would bring that up to 12. And again, don't worry about line spacing. There's another video showcasing exactly what's going on there. So as long as your indentation is set to zero, zero, and the spacing before is six, the spacing afterwards 12, you can then click OK. And everything you do from now on in your report will be properly scaled out in relation to spacing. Now, if it's a case whereby you have got a large chunk of your document created already, then what you can do is again, go to top left corner, top right corner, sorry, click select, left click select all, and again, that will select all the information in your document. If you then right click on any of the text anywhere, come down again to paragraph, left click, and you can see that's going to give us again a host of options here. Again, just make sure your indentation is zero and zero. And then where it says spacing there, we can again increase that to six. We'll increase the space now afterwards till 12. Again, don't worry about the line spacing just yet. And then if you click OK, again, that will appropriately adjust your text as required to give that particular spacing. And you can see, of course, that whenever you hit the enter button from now on, there's a reasonable space between this top paragraph here and the next one, which again makes it a lot easier for the reader to sort of move down and to break the information in the nice chunks. And that finishes up this video then.